I just wanted to say what God said. He said they did this exact same thing to me when I was pregnant with Melbourne. And when I, I, I'm still over here by the shopping plaza um, with all of my bags uh, like this and, and, and walking around like this. They did the exact same thing. He was beating on me while I was pregnant with Melbourne. Um, they put me out of my apartment. They evicted me out of my apartment when I was pregnant with Melbourne, conspiring white women. Um, and I had to be in the hospital when I was pregnant with Melbourne. Um, and they were also, God said they were saying that the baby was not Austin's. Um, they, and they were. They were saying that Melbourne was not Austin's baby. And they had me walking around trying to find another apartment. So the persecution that they are doing to me and my children, God said there will be repercussions. So everybody can sit around laughing all you want because the last time they did it, I had a one bedroom and they caused me a white woman named Maria put me out of my one bedroom apartment because Austin was beating on me and knew that I was pregnant and he had went to jail and she still put me out and she knew that it was not me and I ended up getting a two bedroom and God said now I'm going to get me a three bedroom. So the more you do evil to me, the more he going to bless me and y'all seeing just how much evil they doing, but I just prayed at this time when God blessed me again that you know he he protects us from them because they keep getting jealous I had got I got I had a car they keep getting jealous and it's to the point where they trying to murder me and my children out of jealousy and have us walking around out here like this and it is just ridiculous and I pray that you know God will guard us from these wicked ass strange children you know, um, that's enjoying seeing us walking around like this. They hate, they hate black women, you know, um, especially pretty ones. They hate us. So, and black men, they hate us. These white men, they hate us. You know what I'm saying? And they watching me, they did the same exact thing to me. You know, they tried to starve us and then opening the food and poisoning it. And then over here thinking they gonna get away with the shit. Um, they tried to have me walking around pregnant with Melbourne just like this. Um, and so now they all cahoots with black women and my own family who are jealous of me um, just to have me out here like this and I got to walk past these persecutors over here um, right over here in front of the store because everybody knows what they're doing to me out here and I just got to be courageous and I'm actually keeping my camera on while I walk past them because they are just as evil um, it, it, God said America is what they doing. you don't do that shit to no woman and everybody want to sit around, especially black women. And, and but God said it's the black men that he that's gonna get the vengeance because they know what's going on and they the main ones trying to perpetuate this bullshit against me, knowing that I'm out here pregnant and they playing with God. You can you can you ain't gotta be scared of me. But the vengeance that's coming from the Lord on these black men in America, they all know I'm out here pregnant like this. And they helping to try to keep me out here on the streets lying and I told y'all murder is involved. Because when people can't keep you down, and when God continues to bless you, regardless, and provide your needs, regardless, people try to murder you after that. Because it ain't nothing else they can do. It ain't nothing else you can do. What can you do? I give birth, I gave birth to a beautiful baby boy, and they tried to, first of all, kill, kill the baby when I was carrying him. Everybody in the neighborhood was trying to fight me when I was carrying Melbourne and have me out on the streets, denying that he was Austin's baby. And then want to turn around and steal him, you know. So, I trust in my God. I just had to keep the camera on for me to get past some fake ass people because everybody knows that I'm walking up and down the road pregnant and they are lying. They are denying me medical care and they are trying to have me murdered. And y'all see these black men are jealous because I won't get them no pussy. So they quick to want to try to join in and help some white girls kill a black girl because the white girls is quick to get a pussy up to these black men and I am. I won't give it to them. You got to show me some love and respect. Just like I said with my baby daddy. And they got in his head to start disrespecting me. And he stopped getting pussy. And that's when he started raping me. And God said he was raping me and he was. But anyway, I got to get on my journey now, y'all. I'm right here by the highway and I have to walk two miles. I have to walk two miles. I walk two miles here to get food that was tampered. Um, and then I gotta walk two miles back 
um, with all these bags and stuff on my shoulders. So let me go ahead and get on my journey. Um, let me take these covers off. Because I'm going to just fold. I'm going to hold them. And I'm going to get on my journey. And I'm going to do this with my God. Because they, 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 my sisters were so hateful. They was always hoping I would be out on the streets all uh, fucked up. And they over there trying to work with people that want to have me killed. You know, they are evil. 